how's it going everybody this is collector and son it's been a little while since we well we missed a member really a monday that you know never happens we apologize for that i was in las vegas having a good time i guess and well the collector didn't want to film on his own but we're on our way to chicago for another trip to the chicago sports spectacular this time in november i think we have some cool autograph guests we're gonna see and we are about halfway to chicago so we will keep you guys posted as we go along on this road all right so the collector and i have officially made it to the hotel in chicago for the show and we are a little bit further behind so we have about an hour and a half before the show closes on friday so we're going to check that out and when we get back we'll give you guys a room tour and all that good stuff till then on our way to the show picked another hotel with a walkway gotta do it So we made it back from the show. Uh, we only got to spend about an hour and a half, but it was a productive hour and a half. We had some issues with one of the autograph tickets we bought. Collector, if you'd like to explain it. Yes, we bought the Jerry Rice full-size uh, item, which was going to be a full-size 49er someone, of course. Nobody makes those anymore. Not the vintage ones from when he played. It's all the... Uh, the new type helmets, you know, they had the, somebody had a camouflage one and somebody had, you know, the, the speed ones with the holes in them. It's not something that Jerry Rice played with. So it's some, I didn't want to get that helmet. And so what we did instead, we traded in our Jerry Rice, unfortunately, autograph ticket for a couple other ones instead. What we did is we um, purchased uh, for the same price since we had a credit on the Rice ticket, Charles Woodson inscription, uh, Rudy, uh, yeah. Gotta get Rudy, uh, mini helmet, and an Emmett Thomas, Kansas City Chiefs mini helmet. So we'll be getting those on Sunday. So I think that was uh, that was a wise you know thing to do because I didn't know what else to do. We have Jerry Rice on a mini helmet. We have Jerry Rice on a jersey. The one thing I wanted was a full size helmet. Since they didn't have it, there was no point in getting it on a mini helmet again. Yeah, you say it was a wise thing to do, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why you're not happy with Rudy. I thought you should have done something else, but you did what you did. What so did you think? What we were you looking for? Well, I thought you should have got a Marvin Harrison mini helmet oh. for the same price because they said that he's a very rare autograph guest and well, he's a Hall of Famer. Yeah, I'm just not. Is Rudy a Hall of Famer? No, but Rudy's iconic. I mean, look at, he's got a movie. Does Marvin Harrison have a movie? Who Get likes him? movies? I haven't seen a Marvin movie. So. All right, well, we also picked up a box, a leaf box, four autographs in there, one Hall of Famer. So we're going to open that for you guys right now. All right, the collector is opening the box. He's using his car keys here. And it did work. Need a scissors or a knife of some sort. Of course, we don't now have that. These... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is going to be a challenge. Now, these um, boxes, I believe it's just the four cards. I believe so, yeah. So, this will be quick. Not a lot of uh, ready? random common cards, just autographs. So, how do we want to do this? I don't know. You tell me. I think we show the people first, and then I'll try to guess one, you try to guess one, so on and so forth. So, how do I do this? So, here, I will, I'll take over the cards here. Thank you. And here they are. So here we go. The first card. Can I take a look? Yep. Michael. Not sure. Someone. <laughs> what school do you go to? Uh, no idea. Okay. Well, that wasn't the right, best. The next oh. card. Uh, Anthony Heinz the third. Any idea? Nope. <laughs> so far, not so good. Third card. So for a Hall of Fame, we'll do so. Oh, Zach Wilson. That's Look at a that. Pretty huge ball. Wow. All right. Oh First round, goodness. number two overall pick. Wow. That is a winner right there. Now let's just hope he has a good career. 
And wow. Finally, it's going to be our Hall of Famer. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Well, let's look at the back of the It network. could be Zach Wilson could be our Hall of Famer. Cause I think he assuming. is, yeah. <laughs> Jets to the moon. All right, and then lastly. No way. Why a tittle? That's one I, oh, yeah. That's, that's that worth the, it. That was a pretty reasonably priced box. And two guys, eh. but Zach Wilson, Y.A. Tittle, not too bad. That's a pretty good pull. I think we just used up all our luck on this one box. <laughs> I think exactly. we better stop right now. I think we should just buy individual cards now from wow. dealers. No more boxes. But wow. Y.A. Tittle, he hasn't been around. I mean, he's passed away a few years ago. We have his autograph on a um, 8x10 photo and a mini helmet. And also on our uh, Football Hall of Fame helmet. He's one of our autographs, but now on a card, so that's pretty good. It's pretty sweet. Yeah, that was well worth All it. All right, well, this uh, trip is already off to a better pack <laughs> opening start than the last one. We're about to go get some food, and we'll catch you guys there. So the collector and I are back. I got a burrito from this cool taco place in a strip mall, and the collector got McDonald's. So we just finished our dinner, and I'm going to hop over and edit this vlog for you guys we have an early day tomorrow when's our first autograph collector mm, maybe 10 30 i'm not sure 10 30 so not too early but still want to get some rest who are you most excited to see tomorrow collector woodson yeah charles woodson tomorrow so that's the big ticket item for us being packer fans you know he brought a super bowl to green bay and we're excited for that so until tomorrow Remember to keep it mint. Yeah, mint. Keep it mint, everybody, and we'll see you later.